What's up guys and welcome back to Spore! Now last episode we played through the whole cellular stage. You'll remember that we kind of wrecked the primordial lose all these little guys. Yeah, we just destroyed them all. We became the dominant organism in this little ecosystem, but now, you know what, it's time for us to leave. We have grown ourselves a teeny tiny little brain, and that means it's time for us to evolve legs and go to land. So you're probably thinking we were a microbial organism, now we're going to be moving on to land. What are some of the important things we need? You know, lungs, maybe a waterproof skin? No, none of that stuff's important, that's, that's too complicated. We need legs! <laughs> so we need to put legs on our guy. And that's it. There we go. What a formidable looking creature for now. It's a shame that we can't really do a whole lot in the first stage of customization, but I'll show you guys more once we kind of find more parts. So we will name this Saucasaurus. Yeah. Oh, God. We need to change our body texture. We just look like a... I don't even know. We look like a brain. Oh, our legs are so messed up. There's not, it's not like an elbow, it's like a webbed elbow, so it just looks like it's messed. Our plan is really cool. It's the beginning of a whole new day, and for you, a whole new strange, wondrous world. Air fills your lungs as you stretch into your limbs in, as you stretch into your limbs? It's weird in your new home dry land. The race evolved has begun. Okay. Oh yeah, we look like a disgusting brain. <laughs> look, look at the legs. Like, can we move around? Oh god. Well, you can't say we aren't unique. Oh, here we go. Oh wait, why is there a dead body next to us? Oh, there's like little bits. Oh, we can eat it. <laughs> that poor creature. Um num 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 num. We are terrifying looking. Okay, let's go over here and see what this is. Okay, so those are the parts. So like I was saying, the customization was kind of limited for us earlier on, but you move around, you s What is this? You've discovered a new part. Imagine the cool stuff you'll find on even bigger creatures and skeletons. So yeah, you can either kill creatures to get parts or you can find them. And now we can mate to use that part. Are we a carnivore or an omnivore? I wanted to be an omnivore. I think we're carnivore. But we can always try to eat a fruit. Do you like fruit? Carnivores should only eat meat and herbivores should only eat fruit. Yeah. Okay, I guess we are a strict carnivore, sadly. Just derping our way through the woods. I think our spikes dig into the ground when we walk. Ooh, what are you guys? Hello. What the hell is that? Who's this? You've met a new species. Care to make them a friend or foe? Set your stance to be ready to snarl a new neighbor, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So, you guys are little, and you're called Valas. Kind of cool. But, because you're little, and you fit in my mouth, I'm going to have to eat you. <laughs> Die! <laughs> Got him. <laughs> so now we just eat the corpse. Well done! To the victor goes the spoils. You are on your way to a bigger brain, and it's murder you. So you eat things, you get a bigger brain. That's That's what you need to take out of this game. There we go, we got another one, and we found a hand. You had a hand, and you were holding out on me all along. So I'm not killing these guys out of spite. I'm not, I'm not evil. Oh, I'm really hurt, though. Can I eat heal? I can. Excellent. But yeah, I'm killing them because you get a challenge. You can see in the top left is this hunt. Hunt one more Valo. So we needed to hunt three, and then we would get 20 DNA. And DNA is, like, the currency for buying things. You remember in the first episode, like, if we wanted to buy a new mouse or something like that, we needed DNA to do it. Come here, you. Run from my wobbly legs. What is that? It's it's dancing. It looks like a scyther. Let's go talk to it. Hello, scary organism. You guys are called bonies. Bonnies? Bonnies. You have a bunch of alpha bonnies and a baby bonnie. Okay, I think we're gonna make friends with these guys, because they're not only bigger than us, but they're also terrifying. Can I can I be your friend? How do I be your friend? Let's sing. Oh, oh crap, I need to sing. Sing. No, don't rage! Oh god! What did I do? I scared it away. 
You are really bad at making friends. I don't want to bang you, I swear. I just want to sing. There we go. Okay, so it's kind of like the attack system where you just go back and forth. Oh, crap, what are you? Oh my god, oh my god, what just happened? What the hell? What do you mean I was killed in battle? There was no battle. Those, like, Velociraptor bug things came out of nowhere and one-shotted me. Once again, we are not an individual, we are a species. So where one dies, the species lives on. Man. Okay, we need to go back to the bonies. Or the bonnies. I'm gonna call them bonies, because that's funny. And, uh, and impress them. Oh, come on, get there. Yeah! Alright. So now we have a friend. Ooh, and I think I just got a bigger brain. That's, that's a brain look to me. Yeah! We're just a little bit smarter, because we made a friend. Brain power. You've grown a little smarter and taken your first step towards sentience. You have earned the ability to entice an ally to join your pack and help you on your adventures. Okay, so I can like I can actually bring friends with me and I can make a pack. These guys don't look like fighters though. They're more breeders, so we'll leave them be. We don't need a pack yet, I don't think. Ooh, hello. What are you and your terrifying little faces? <laughs> not a penis. Okay. Hello, little not a penis. No, don't, don't you be mad at me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna woo you. Sing to the not-a-penis. Oh, did it just shoot? It just shot me. Okay, if that's how you want to be. Oh, that's not fair. Run away. Ow, penises are mean. Okay, you know what? I think it's time we mate. So we are gonna hop on the old creature tinder and find ourselves a lady. Actually, probably find ourselves a man. Seems to be the case in this game. What are you saying? Oh, we gotta click on you, okay. Because we got some extra things that we don't need. Like we have five mouths, but in this you can only attack with one. So that's like 60 DNA points that we can use. Poop down an egg real quick. Okay, you know what? I think I think we need to revamp everything. I think we need to go back to the drawing board on this guy because it's just not working out. Add some legs. Okay, and we can add some arms. Ooh, actually, I know what we're starting to look like here. Put this right there. <laughs> we kind of look like a pincer, a little bit. I want to know if I can actually attack people with that thing on the top of my head or if that's going to work or not. A little, little bit like a pincer, I'm kind of liking this. What is a butter bib? Oh, they're like graspers. Oh my god, you're kidding me. <laughs> yes! I don't even, I can't even remember if pincer has graspers or not, to be honest, but who doesn't want graspers? Oh my god, we are looking badass. Okay, he did not have graspers, but I still like them, so we're gonna keep them. So we are gonna name him... Let's see, we're gonna name him Pincer Sauce. Oh my god, the, the children, the eyes, the eyes on the children are the same size as the rest of them. It is terrifying looking. It's interesting because, like, not only do you evolve, but also other species evolve. So, like, if I had left these guys alive, they probably would have evolved into, like, a larger slug tribe or something like that. You never know. I'm curious if you can kill everything on the planet. Do you just evolve and there's nothing left? <laughs> must not be the case. There must be a way, like, a failsafe or something. I think the further away you go from your original, like, location, the more complex things get. Because, like, these are stegosauries. These guys are pretty complicated. Oh my god, it's the evil guys. The gene ops. Oh no, no, no. Oh, I, no, run away, run away, run away, what the hell? What are those things? Oh, what are you? Ah, uh, where do these things come from? Oh, uh, pincers, help me. 
Help! No, they keep stunning me. You guys can see me. Help! Help! Get them! Get them, guys! Yeah, what now? Huh? What now? Beast on your corpse. Oh crap, help that guy, help that guy, help that guy. Alpha Pincer, help him! Yeah, we did it! Oh crap! Am I mating? Nothing like feasting on the flesh of our enemies and then mating over it. <laughs> Thank you, Alpha Pincer, for impregnating me. <laughs> this game. Okay, I've gotten in I've gotten a new idea in mind. You're, you're just gonna have to trust me. You're just gonna follow me on this one here, because I think this could be really cool. There we go. <laughs> now, if that's not a terrifying looking creature, I don't know what is. <laughs> it's kind of like a a walrus mixed with a centaur. I I don't know. Okay, that's that's what we're gonna call this the uh, the wall tour. <laughs> what can I say, man? Evolution's a weird thing. <laughs> Yes, fellow Waltors, we will rule this world. <laughs> I wanted to see what a bipedal organism looked like. So, like, if we had, if we had multiple legs, what happens? Oh man, we are crazy now. We run really fast too. Oh, these things are awesome. They're like, these things are. What? What is that? Run away! Oh my God, it's huge! <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna make friends with the silly monkey men. This game sucks. Everything kills me. I think that's gonna be it for this video, guys. I know that I'm only like 20% of the way through the creature stage, but I've been recording for like an hour and a half. It is a really long stage, and I don't want this video to be like any more than 15 minutes. It's like the most, because you're just gonna see the same things over and over again. So I'm really looking forward to the tribal stage and to the civilization stage and space. That's when the game really starts to change. It really gets interesting. But thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.